It will say a name, then you say a name, and then we'll say Lemon Ice Cube. My name is Vincent Barbaccia. My name is Michael Zampino, and this is the Lemon Ice King of Corona. We grew up in this area, the area is Corona, Queens. It's just a regular neighborhood. I mean, you don't see any fancy shops coming up there, or, you know, $15 cup of coffee. It ain't happening. We, we worked here throughout school years, and then eventually got it more involved in the business. And at one point where uh, it was ripe, we took over the business. We bought the business for the original owner, Pete Van Verimo. And uh, we were like his uh, sons, you know, to him. And he treated us as such, right? The original flavor was lemon. He makes the old fashioned way, squeezing the lemon, squeezing the oranges. So supposedly somebody came up to him and said, you know what, you, you make the best ices in the world, and you're the lemon ice king. And that's how, supposedly, that's how it's stuck. We're here 72 years, all we do is ice. We use New York City tap water. That's the big secret. The secret formula. Just, we, we're the only two that know it. There's no gum in it, there's no gluten in it. We'll, we'll get a, a tractor trailer full of lemons and oranges. Then we squeeze them, we bottle them and freeze them, and then we take them out according to whatever batches we're making. So you're not getting any kind of a concentrated uh, lemon and orange, because we could go that route, but it's not the same. And it's all, it's all water-based, no dairy. Yeah, it goes hand in hand. They get a nice, they go in the park, they watch them play bocce, spend the night, come back, get another ice, and go back over there. I remember when we were kids, we wouldn't even think of stepping on that court. That was like, you know, no, you don't do that. You watch from the side. Now everybody, you know, I got next, so you got next. Everybody gets a chance to play. 90% of the kids who we hire, we know these kids because we watch them grow up, you know, which, is, which is a good thing. It's a good thing all the way around. You know? So we like sort of like give back to the neighborhood. So you're always with your friends, you know, and, and if they weren't your friends initially, they become good friends. We see guys now that left here, now they're cops, uh, they're accountants, they're lawyers, and they all come back here and they say this is like one of the best experiences they ever had, you know, so, which is nice. And it's like initially it was the best experience we ever had. And now we're experiencing the ultimate experience. I mean, we're the boss, you know, which is nice. Rosie, so, the queen of Corona. But we knew a Rosie, so it might be a reference to her. She was a friendly person. She didn't run the neighborhood, but everybody knew her in the neighborhood.